All righty, welcome back. Thank you so much for hanging up with us right here on Why in the Morning. You are still hanging up with us on the hashtag Why in the Morning everywhere on all our social media platforms. Soon as at Pantapale, Facebook, Instagram, and on Twitter as well is at Y254 channel. And our social media zangu ni Brian Sako 101. And on to our MCM segment today, right now, we are going to talk about matters relationship. And the question is, by the way, Katia, honestly, love and money. Nigani na make relationship in a strong sana, especially right now. I don't know about you, but I'd love to hear your feedback on that one on our social media platforms. Katia, honesty, love, and money. Gani na make relationship is in a strong sana, especially right now in this current generation we are living in. I don't know. I'd love to hear from you. And joining me live right in studio with us right now, they have been here before last week and we said we must continue this conversation. Is Nyakonch Daniel, who's a, a second year political science student at the University of Nairobi. And then we've got John Odwar, who's a media practitioner as well. Thank you, gentlemen, and welcome back. Good morning. Good morning. Sasa, uh, let's get into this interesting topic. Okay, uh, relationship manze kuna factors, flani zinafanya relationship in a flourish. And uh, it's, not, it's not necessarily that ita, ita kuwa na script. Flani is that usipofanya hivi, itaende kuwa hivi. Lazima ikuwa uh, your own personal experience and journey ambayo itafanya. You learn from each other, you're meeting this new person, you must learn from them and also they learn from you so that you guys can come together. More agreement and now, this is what we are going to do to ensure that relationship here to in a flourish. In this current generation, what exactly can we do to ensure that, you know, our relationship, see necessarily I take we're romantic, most people can mention relationship is about dating, marriage, even it could be a relationship between you and your, you know, uh, your employer as well. So to keep it going, to keep it afloat, what exactly do you think to Nazafania? I think we have so many types of relationships. Right. And then, in a lingana relationship, Painagani. Love relationship that mm -hmm. requires money, a little money, and then it requires honesty. Work mm -hmm. relationship requires pure honesty and good work and, de and dedication, like in a lingana relationship type gani. Yeah. Right. Factors in a very kulingana na relationship. Yeah. yeah. Uh, co experience yako, una dani nini lifanya relationship kulikuwa na in the past, ika flourish ama ika feel? First is dishonesty. Dishonest. Yeah, it's not all about money, just dishonesty. Uh -huh. yeah. So who is dishonest? Both of you are dishonest to each other? Ama, ama the partner and you are called dishonest? I think the partner is called dishonest. More dishonest, let me use that term. Okay. Yeah. But why her and <coughs> not you? <laughs> you know, there's, there's this factor, kuna vitu, sometimes kuna, una, una, una taka kwa relationship, una, there's something you want. There's, there's, there's this perception you created. I'm looking for a lady who is like this and this. So if you can't get what you want, it will force you to quit the relationship. Right. Uh, let me throw it back to you, Mr. Daniel. What are some of the factors that Tuneza sink to ensure Manzema relationships that is in a flourish? She necessarily is a romantic, is a kikazi, kifamilia. Because what you began, by the way, what you kosana, wengina wajai, ungeleshana for long. And wako, wako related, wame toka ni, wanasema ni, ni brother, sama siblings wa, toka ni toki, ya. Yeah. Wanachukiana, wajaya wange, uje isikia story ya msia, nasema, eh, miss jaya wange, anasizi tangu si juu 20, since 1990, wajaya wange, ya. Juu, walipigana tu, na ukiangale some of the things that led to the fallout, are actually so many, like, so tiny little things, when you wange sit down, wange have conversation, na relationship yao, yendele tu sao. Um, just a, uh, the same way you said, generally about relationship it is about biblically it is about love yeah, yeah. so we read that love conquers all yeah so the same way you mentioned the family issue if you both of you didn't grow in love then there's no way both of you will retain that love when you're adults now now maybe other relationships i think just the brother said it is about honesty because you can love someone, but you're not honest. In the end, when all the things you said is not honest, then it is, it is nothing, so it, will, it won't proceed. All right. Yeah. Uh, Pesa, Pesa is a linked to like the basis of most relationships nowadays, especially with Kianza Kudet, a process that would require romantic relationship with Kidogo, which I realize, uh, I don't know if it affects the other gender the most, but you realize like money is like the main. Even families will tell you, eh, 
Oa mtu mwenye natoka kwa a stable financial background atutaki masikini. And then pia kuna that issue like, you know, ukiwa mtu wakona pesa, you're likely to also be a part of the world. Do you think inafanya, in a disenfranchised world, tutuwa kwa lazy, akingoja mtu mwenye wakona pesa, akujamuwa, ama oleki kwa mtu wakona pesa? So, um, flashing back, money is a flavor, I think so, in a relationship, money is a flavor. It is, some, it, it is a supplement, yeah? So when we flash back, those people who are, who are someone who is 60 or 70 years old now, they used to come from nothing. That Those are the tycoons we say we see right now. Those are the millionaires right now. So if we can copy from someone, as long as we both love each other, then you know your dream, then you know what you want, then you can build up together from nothing. So it is not, all, it is not all about money, because money, Sincerely, if you're dating the gender, let me say the ladies, if you're dating a lady who has got money and you don't have a money as a man, then there's no respect. You, no. at least you need to be somewhere. So even a, man, a lady has a money, then <coughs> you can stand on your own, not being supported with the other gender, because biblically, it is for men yeah. to be the head and to be the head of the family and be responsible to take care of the, the other gender. Right, uh, yeah. John. Yeah. There's a song, there's an R&B, I think it's a soul R&B song that says, no romance without finance. <laughs> Do you think that, you know, that song is true? And you can live it, it's a soundtrack about, you know, like, kama haona peso sinyongeleshe, kama si business staki, sinipigia, text. To some extent it's not true, to some extent it's true. Aha. Kuna watu that you will appreciate the little you have. They struggle, but you will still grow together. There's these other people also, they just want money. They want extreme money. So in a Lingana situation and the and the expectation of your partner. Kunawatu watakuja kwa they'll date you because you have well. They'll date you because you have money. So what they want from you is just your money. There's these other humble people outside here, innocent girls, they'll date you just because they want love from you. Because right. they want you to grow together. Right. So it varies. And then I'm also agreeing with my friend. Money is just a, com a component that will spice love. Yeah. Uh, I remember something. Speaking of spicing love, they say uh, f behind every successful man is a beautiful, powerful, prayerful. Kwanza prayerful. Prayerful, yeah. yeah. Prayerful is, yeah. Is, the, is, the, is, the, is the word here. Is it true that behind every successful man is uh, a powerful, prayerful woman, financially stable woman, or just literally? A beautiful woman. It's true because there's so many guys outside here. It, it doesn't. It doesn't mean that you, a woman will be just behind a successful man. There will be just the, this woman whom he love. No, we have our mothers also. Oh, they are behind us. They are praying for us. So even yeah. behind successful men, there's be, behind successful man there is a woman. So you see, necessarily at any love, love. money, baby, money, girlfriend. Ah, sometimes it's our, our prayer warriors. Or prayer exactly. masters, uh -huh. our mothers, yeah. Have you ever had a, a very supportive, uh, let's say, mama, apart from your mom? Because I remember in the last discussion you mentioned that your mom prays for you a lot. I have have a, you ever met like a lover who's supportive when you're not saying, yes, behind every sex, apart from my mom, my lover was? Yeah, I think. Kuna moja. Uh -huh. one somewhere. How did it go? And how did you feel, Okati? You know, you received the support and. It's, you are it's, like flourishing. It's doing well. It's doing well. Uh -huh. Okay, let me throw it back to you, uh, Daniel. Is it true? Yeah, it is true. Um, yes, I have, uh, apart from my mom, yes, I have, uh, um, he's a doctor right now, he's the one, like he lo she loves me so much and I love her so much. Oh, so mm -hmm. she's the one responsible for my education. So right. it's, all ab it's not all about money. It's all about if someone is prayerful the same way you have said, right. and also me, for my experience, what I've seen and engaged with some youths, na na kumbuka ili group is a vijana kila mtu na pati na experience. Would advise kila mtu to just look a prayerful woman, then you'll be successful. Because ukiangalia hawa watu what, let's start from our president, Rigadi Yachagua. Those people are talking about my wife always pray day and the night. So right. I think prayer is the powerful thing. Yeah. Right. Let's come back to love. As in, 
how do you tell that napendo kwa hii relationship because <laughs> kuna 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 so many uh, stories as well as you know so many signs zenye zinaonyesha eh huyu mtu ananipenda na si necessarily <laughs> to mend the date ama so I'd, I'd just like to know for, as a man from a man's perspective how do you tell that this lady loves me so much this fine babe is killing me with love i think being there for you uh-huh. ako hapo anakusaidia being there for you inamaanisha she's supporting your hustle she's advising you she's standing with you kuna so many factors uh-huh. si kupea pesa unajua sometimes hata ukiamka asubuhi akwambie ah babe leo una kapo you'll just feel like wow napendwa yeah, yeah. Uh-huh. babe leo umechoka umerudi kwa umechoka how can i help you wow napendwa so kuna so many things kuna long calls conversations and uh-huh. then kuna also correcting you apa apa ukufanya poa apa yeah. we should do it this way and then kuna some advices we should do this we should invest so utafeel to ah kumbe hapa hapa ni kama napendwa and right. then unajua kuna kwa the other side also if you yeah, know from ha yeah apa pia sipendwi sana italingana na stories unaambiwa and then unajua sometimes communication is key make up for three days she's not checking on you kama uja text he's not she's not texting kama uja tuma good morning good morning au party like crickets yeah uko tu hapo tu wewe ndio unamcall wewe ndio unamtext you know to some extent to feel it's uh-huh. draining you right to uh-huh. feel like ah hey, mtu kwa ni shida nini you will just feel i'm not loved but unajua right. ukiamka asubuhi unalia yeah. ah aiwa wewe kumeamka ah, babe nitakuamsha like yeah give me your plan for the day give me your plan for the week so like uta feel to unapendwa yeah. right. it's not necessarily man yeah uh, wengine wetu hata sometimes atuitaji hiyo pesa sana tutumie hiyo pesa yako sana exactly. just be there for us and support you, our hustle yeah being there being um, present yes. and uh, supporting the hustle okay. before we come back to i, I want I, i'd really like to know from you yeah. both of you all, the love language your men uh, like in a kwanga gani specifically most common but before we get to men's love language nataka uh, let me throw it back to just you just want Daniel. to ask something Exactly. You've talk, the brother has talked about supporting your hustle. What do you mean by a lady supporting your hustle? A lady supporting your hustle is like see kuna kitu unafanya right? There is a hustle you are doing right? The supporting your hustle hustle lady can give you money. Sometimes lady can just tell you rectifying you. Hapa hujafanya poa. Kama kuna watu wenyewe wanafanya content creating, anakuambia no for this content na feel to ifanye hivi ama ungeifanya hivi ingetoka poa kabisa kuna guys kwa street wanauza anakuambia ah pale kama unauza smoky so ongeze chapo hapo kando like kuna advices mtu akikwambia you will just feel this person is supporting my hustle like okay yeah, yeah. not grading you yeah. kwanza mimi utembea tao una feel place unaona boy anauza smoky na demu yake kwa hapo kando sometimes mm-hmm. ametoka class amekuja yeah. kumsaidia like you feel okay, yeah, yeah. Well, and come up this these are two love buds meant to be together for yeah. Talk, now uh, talking uh, about that i've not ex- experienced mambo na love but what i do here some when are you, <laughs> when are you <laughs> going to experience <laughs> love bro come on now so this uh, this this scenario where you had people saying mtu anapigiwa tu mtu akitaka dem akitaka pesa ndio anapigiwa when your brother me same anamka asubuhi this is no good morning yeah. umeshindaji so ikifika ile day ameshikwa mahali na doa anataka pesa ndio utapigiwa eh na umepotea uko aje haki nime nimekwama mahali nifanyie fe, favor uh-huh. any time for favor ndio unaona call so i think that is money based i'm supporting kuna wasana yeah. ukiona there their messages your three message ukiona siku amekutext sana that is money that's money yeah. uh-huh. kuna watu tu akikutext tu like eh mtu ameni text and then the first message atakuja na na sai ka text the first one the second one the third one please i do me a favor favor gani ukimuliza tu which favor at is you like 3000 unajua we boys tukikopesha ladies like wadaisha ni ngumu so is like unampea tu for the sake ya kumpea right yeah, yeah. Let's come back to love language and uh, I had mentioned uh, what, what what are some of the things that we do to appreciate our better house ama uh, to say to uh, some of the moves we make to actually give them some little assurance kuambia kwamba eh baby girl nakupenda ama nikifanya hivi in as much as I told you I love you baby ama I love you babe at least you move in our nyesha that this is love and i think it varies from different men as well as different women because everybody has their own love language I, i'd really like to know yours and compare it with daniel's uh, i think i think mine ikiku introduce kwa mbogi 
like my friends ah. there's this confidential unajua kuna mtu kila msa na kuna your psycho so like right. when i introduce you to my small psycho like it's feel like nakupenda that's why i'm introducing you to these guys kama unaona we are just there but i'm not i'm not introducing you to the group is like utaniaibisha na your group so time nianza ku introduce kwa my group my family i'm comfortable with you yeah yeah so that's for you that's another yeah. love language but you know apoinje kuna jamaa wenye wenye ata treat them like what wapeleka wakunywe that's also their love language all right yeah kuna wase wakipeleka dem church and i'm introduced to their church that's also a love language so right. inalingana um sana pia amelelewa aje and then inalingana u dem anataka ni unajua kuna wase we are just dating like for the sake of dating we are just dating for enjoyment so hiyo pia kuna different love language all right yeah Daniel so the test of love to me i think you just have to appreciate your wife or your girlfriend uh-huh. sa surprise her. and also after appreciation yes compliment her then finally ukijua now this is the one now take her to your mom his mom is alive uh-huh. i think, feel like i feel like i think i deserve this is it my surprises and don't get una jamaa sema tu surprise so you come on i'm surprised na gun i'm on on i don't know surprises ni kama exactly to me a lady who loves you doesn't need big surprises just appreciate your maybe umbaye kata hata kama kanguo dress akuje to home apart umembaye nguo ya maybe 4000 3000 si tumembaye nguo okay yeye amezoea anaenda anafanya shopping ya 100 nguo ju madam wana buy nguo cheap sana Uh-huh. Mungu zao ni chief sana. So kikuja. You think so? Uh, yeah. I think mungu zao madam ni chief and dance man. No, yeah. Okay. Men huwa ni mungu zao ni cheap expensive, expensive. sana. Okay. So ude makikuja apate home ile nguo huwa naona kipita na she cannot afford that. Napate umemsurprise na I think she will feel very very loved. I'm supporting his yeah. sentiment. Uh-huh. See at mungu ya 4000. Nanulia baby girl chocolate. Yeah, 230. Uh-huh. Now I see what you're doing. Yeah, typical <laughs> crepes. Uh-huh. Yeah, 170. Nunulia <clears throat> typical these to small, sa- small things. To right? sa- ka- sa- too smart. Right. Peleke m surprise. I think is a small surprise surprises. Pia huwa zina nini a lot. They uh-huh. meant a lot to some ladies outside here. Yeah. Eh, ita baby mama out kidogo kidogo. Mwende mm. mtembee inalingana na pesa yako na mfuko yako. Kama unaweza enda kutembea ki, ki place fulani tu poa chill mpige story unajua hiyo also will increase the bonding. Yeah. yeah. The bonding ita ita, ita kuwa, ita grow like because tamuna chill the conversation will be there. She right. will open up. Kuna vitu you will start learning from her that you don't know. I right. think create time for her. Unajua hiyo time also. Talking, yeah, Daniel, about, reacting. talking yeah. about taking a lady out. We have some ladies with the, this personality of mi badala ya kwenda out here to chill tu na wewe tukae tu uh-huh. tu ama to watch tu net, netflix tu netflix and yeah chill. so how can you define such a how where because you can't learn um, the attitude of a person you know, a lady who kenda out you know, you know you, you might... think so you think you can't learn that no 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 why <laughs> why, why, why 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 because why um to say me 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 chill kwa nyumba ama me kaa kwa nyumba that story the, he, he mentioned communication Uh-huh. the kind of uh, story the kind of discussion who dem atakuwa na discuss akiona kila kitu social media akiona kitu mna watch obviously utajua tu the mindset ya ude mkikaa tu hivyo so in short wewe utakuwa na msoma tu yeah <laughs> but I've, I've, i've heard i've heard people go on house dates it works i don't know it works in the modern day world like instead of us going to a restaurant and spending money why can't we spend that cash in the house we the, cook yeah, yeah. and we do the netflix and chill I, in the mansion i think that is a wife now Or you you feel like that is yeah, now worth material that, yeah. she I'm don't say, want to i'm supporting his sentiment okay. yeah. from different so, perspective yes. first i must know the, the type of person i'm dating okay. I, i must know what he likes and what he doesn't like that is it's simple as that so lazima ni joe mtu anapenda she's outgoing anapenda kwenda hizi ma, ma outdoor event kuna mtu anapenda kwa mtu indoor kuna watu introvert they don't like even uh, socializing with people uh-huh. so i must know i must be in a position to know huyu mtu anapenda hii na hii uh-huh. that's when you can surprise someone with chocolate na pendi chocolate mm. like, yeah but they yeah. Yeah. lazima ujue huyu mtu yeah. anapenda nini yeah. so kitu anasema pia is that means you so, spent time to know her yeah. Yeah. yes yeah. That's the likes and dislikes that's what i mean yeah. i must know the lady i'm dating kuna watu wapendi kutoka tu kimwambia toke ukimwambia mtatoka maybe at one 
you'll end up going out six. <laughs> Ata mtaenda ya. Ata mtaenda. Mm. Takuwa hapo na vaa ingu wa natuwa. Fanyi hiya. Fanyi. Like ataki tu na hizi kuambia. I don't want. Kuna madema ata kuwa socialize na your friends. Haizi ya hizi kapo. Ukienda na na mabeshte kijani ya atakuwa na lala. So, lazima ujua ya nataka ni napeta. But some, to some... Amani mtu introvert. Amani tuseme ni extrovert. As in, learning even personalities of your love as well. Before you even, you know, yeah, prioritize start. on the things muna fanya. You want to do for her. It's very important. Yeah. So, yeah. yu kitu wamesema ati muna kana imu na watch movie, nini, nini. That also will help you to learn her. Okay. Even going out and interacting with people will help you to learn more about her. Juu uh -huh. kutasikia her sentiment about people, about some reactions. Unajua sayi kuna kitu mtu wakefanya and then uniambie, umutu wanakai vivi ya like, okay, this is your perception about this character. This is your right. perception about this character. Kuna watu, ndiza kutana beshitako, nunaona beshitako and meitisha food na unasikia kikwambia, ayo beshitako siya nakula sana. That's also you will start just learning, ya nachukulia watu hivi. Ayo beshitako siya naomba sana, like, so yeah. you will huh. get to know them even before you introduce them to your family. Right. Yeah. I remembered something. Kuna, kuna, there's a, there's a, I think there's a motivation speaker, a Kenya motivation speaker, I'll call Nongela story, uh, men who come from broken homes, or literally he was using an, an, a black American example where most uh, black American men, this is men now, are still learning how to treat, you know, women because um, they come from broken homes where, you know, there was no father or yes. there was lack of both of them or there was one. And because they grew up in a single parent home setup, they only go to see how, you know, to be with a woman. That is maybe from a single mother's perspective. Or maybe if she's a lady, she only go to see how to be with a father or maybe since she's uh, she grew up with a single mother she only knows how to be with women she doesn't know how to treat a man how to you know act in front of a man in terms of relationship wise because in fact that knowledge was not ingrained in her while she was growing up so she also ends up being a single mother or you also end up being a single father because either the conscious energy that was supposed to grow in you while you're being born yeah. just because your father was not there and then after she he went ahead and mentioned the story of sexuality and whatnot which you're not going to talk about do you feel like even it's still it's still an issue with us here in africa yeah where uh young men we come from broken homes where there's no father or there's no parent at all and i can pick a place you could get into a relationship it becomes even ten thousand times hard because first of all how do you how to be romantic how do you can and by the time you're learning it it's around 35 40 which i'm not saying is an old age but at least time you man by the time you are learning from you know experiences so it becomes how do you feel like you know contribute also to like you know treating men and women badly in relationships i think i think it's a big challenge we are facing as as, as, as africa in africa right because the, our, our method even our method of how the way we are being raised villetunalelewa also is affecting our relationship <laughs> because we can kwa this let me let me give, give you an example of these families we can say a violent family Right, yeah. Yeah, kuna so many people in your family yao all along imekuwa tu vita 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 vita. Aja experience yao, the romance, the romantic, the is kwa familia yao. So right. the perception I'm talking about from the family, yeah. ni ile ya, men are dogs. Men are dogs. Men are, dogs men are right. this, this right. way. Yeah. Men yeah. are not good people. Men are not meant to be loved. So right. you need perception. By the time at a, at a, at a outside the world, anze kulan itakuwa late to somehow it will somehow late to accept. Okay. Zingine zima affect even the marriages of other people because right. of their past experience. Wewe mama kwa likuwa na treat baba kuhivi. You get this fine man. Treating right. him is very difficult because you won't understand him because of your past experience yeah. or your past perception. Kuna yeah. watu tu familia yao ama their family it may create perception that our oh, watu ni wabaya wanafaa right. kutreatiwa hivi na ni hivyo na ni hivyo so right. easy change and then unajua hii ni kitu amelelewa from age Child, 1 yeah yani immediately alizaliwa alikuwa born into that space yeah. na ni hivyo this this story in ilikuwa ina run ati kuna watu wenye wamelelewa churchly maybe godly aha uh -huh. na family yao imekuwa very nice family baba yao the family, the, the, the parents are going to be and so on and the best girlfriends, are the best wives. Right. Because they are somehow... It applies somehow, to the ladies only, am I even both? Both. Okay. They are somehow submissive. Unajua? Right. Uh -huh. They are somehow submissive. Unajua kama umelelewa, kama mimi unajua ni melelewa na sijayona 
babangu hataki kumbanisha mamangu. I can tell you for sure. Wow, amazing. Sijai, ona, I know wanakunga na their difficult moment. Mm -hmm. But hatujai experience. Amjezi, experience. These, they normally hide it from us. Mm -hmm. uh, you just know, leo, walikuwa na some problems. Si unajua right. unajua umekuwa kwa yu family. But right. auta ona wakijibiana ama mtu wakita. Maybe ho wana sort of issues. Right. Adi uki wa ono ni kama watu they have gloomy face. Kuna issue hapa. But uta iskia. So mi pia also ni me rest ni kijua atufai kugombana hata kama tukona issue mbele ya watoto wetu. Right. We'll go and sort our issues behind the curtains. Right. Hata kama kuna difficult moment. Wageni wakikucha atufai kugombana wageni wajue tulikuwa na issues. Right. We'll sort these issues after. So our parents are our first teachers. Right, too. Yeah, our parents are their f our first teachers. Ondo yeah. watu watu na emulate, we copy from them. It's just copy pasting, right. taking that character na tuna najie. Even the Bible says your first your first god is your yeah. mom and your dad. That, yes. Like they literally tell you how to, you know, understand the things of the world and if the first person to disappoint you is your guardian then it means that chain of disappointment has already been established. Yes. Uh, let me throw it back to you my guy uh, Daniel. Do you feel like uh, now, differently, away from what we were talking about, when it comes to money, especially in, in most established relationships, Utakuta, if uh, the mama is working and uh, the guy is working, it, 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 it realize most of the money being spent near the guy a lot. And uh, they say, you know, a woman's money is her money and a man's money is everybody's money. Is, is it a good thing, by the way, from your experience? Um, I think it... For someone to experience that in marriage, then there's, there, there was a start, yeah? It started from somewhere. Um, it will start when maybe, maybe both of you are dating. So for you to avoid that, you'll experience this. When you're dating, just ask her, what do you, like when you're dating, maybe this lady was not even supporting you, like the brother said. She's not even supporting you, where you go up, you are dating, just people are dating. Right. Yeah, so if a, a lady can support you by the time Badom go down, then just be sure when both of you are earning, you will make good ma manage of man your money. Yeah. Right. I've remembered here. something All from right. my community. Let me give you a good example. From uh -huh. my community, if you want to, ma I want to marry according to community customs. Uh -huh. Oh, well, kwa nasema, that you must identify the family you want to marry from. Yeah. Uh -huh. Kama nile familia ato watu wameko wa kijinyonga, you should not marry from that family. Yeah. Uh -huh. Chukuna hiyo anger in kwa hiyo family. Yeah. Ka Ama it's a pattern. They say a curse. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, it's a curse from that family. <laughs> Kama kuna hiyo family, yeah. enye manini, they are firstborns. Kama we msena ni lastborn. Na they are three firstborns wa jaoleka. You should not marry from that family because the oldest, the elder sister will influence also your wife. So in a yeah. manisha, your wife along the way, piana is a kwacha. So, waliko na piana yu period ya courtship, yeah, dating yeah. period also, to know the best person you want to marry, to know from, to learn more from their family. Kuna hii kitu tunasamanga the night runners, especially, yu kitu waliko na piana na waliko na nini example. Yeah. You should not marry from a night runner family. If your family is, you are not night runners. Right. Because I'm not to accommodate. So, let's go to a courtship duration right. to know, to learn more and to know the character of the family, to dig deep from the other side family. Right. Yeah. Because I'm marriage is a lifetime thing. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I'm told we should close it up by now, but uh, let me just ask, uh, I, I'd love to hear your sentiments on this one. Uh, two seconds each. Katia, honesty and love na pesa. Gani ndo inafai equal so strong in the relationship. Let me start with you, John. As you also say, your social media I think, handles. I think, I think honesty uh -huh. will bring love. Uh -huh. When I'm honest to you, that mean, means I love you. Uh -huh. Money will spice the love. So we require both. Mm, so we need both honesty? Need both. Yeah, we need honesty, uh -huh. love. Uh -huh. And money will spice the love. Wow, I love that. I love that. Your social media? John Odiambo Facebook. TikTok at Jono Diambo, Twitter at Jono Diambo. All right, uh, Daniel, what should be the first priority in a relationship? Everything biblically, just love. Mm -hmm. If someone loves you, he will always be honest, won't mm -hmm. cheat you or hide anything. Because right. there's someone who don't want to hurt you. So love conquers, then honesty follows. Uh, money, I can't talk about money. Money is just a supplement. <laughs> yeah. yeah, it's just a supplement. Yeah. And I love that you say yeah. it's a supplement. Your yeah. social media as we exit yeah. before yeah. I get to the comments. Nyakwachi yeah. Daniel, Facebook and Twitter only. Nya? Nyakwachi Daniel. Nyakwachi Daniel. Yeah. Right. Okay. Idi yeah.
Yeah. All right, uh, tuliko tumekuuliza pale social media uh, kati ya honesty, love na money ni gani na make relationship equal strong sana. And uh, just to sample some of your feedback. All right, good morning. Kati ya honesty, love na re- na pesa, gani nafanya strong inakuwa gani nafanya relationship iwe strong. Hey. Aha, kuna mtu anaitwa uh, Miss Brenda anasema pesa sabuni ya roho. Pesa sabuni ya roho. Mm-hmm. Paris Mudhoni anasema that is Facebook or, or Twitter. That should be Twitter I guess. Uh, anasema reply anasema both ziko fiti. Tena uh, Paris Mudhoni kusema pale chini love and money. And then some Brian ukasema ni kama hakuna these daughters huwezi waelewa. All right. That is from Sam Brian Karanja. And then kuna Papa Rico anasema pesa sana sana. <laughs> hmm. I see what you're doing right there. <laughs> Bosco Classic K anasema morning and morning glory. Okay, sawa <laughs> sawa. Lamek Omariba anasema kutoka kisi mbuya mono kutoka kisi marani with my wife Vero love following. Thank you so much Lamek for watching. And then kuna John Magondo anasema some of us are struggling with relationships as if it is in the 10 commandments. My goodness, I see what you're doing right there. Aha, uh-huh. Herbert Monyumba anasema money hi-fi kwa katikati ya options like honesty and love. Those two are priceless and a difference between mtu wa konazo na mwenye hana ni kubwa sana. Okay. And then Holly Moss anasema main factor honesty and i love the fact that my panelists who mesema pia honesty should be the first item with kenyan tax collector money okay <laughs> i've seen you what you're doing nyagochi still unasema apparently all of them make it strong okay vini uko tuna jina moja like jay z and beyonce unasema relationship ipi mwanzo okay maybe financial Let's say romantic because mostly to mongela romantic and then fiesta filomena peter unasema when you have money I love you and be honest to you. Aki wewe. Aki wewe. Watch. And then kuna Brian Bondia anasema these are three different questions. Hey. Sawa sawa Brian. Okay? And then Kemboy Evans anasema money is everything, love wins siku zote, shida ni pesa. That is what Marsh Mrege and then Ngashi Yulem Cute anasema love na ke couple love emoji pia. Jennifer Mosho anasema pale chini love na ukatupapo love emoji. I love it. I love it. I love it. Kevo Karizu nasema Nairobi good morning honesty msema hapo. Raquel Wairimo msema relationship ni ma what those here. Sawa sawa. Ivy Sanchez anasema money is the greatest of them all. Toa hapo kwa mapenzi kabisa. Okay. <laughs> Continue to send us your sentiments between money love na honesty gani na make relationship in aqua strong thank you so much continue to interact with us and send us your feedback on the hashtag why in the morning everywhere on all our social media platforms we'll be checking your feedback as we exit the show as we continue to interact with you facebook instagram and on twitter is at y254 channel my social media personally is at brian soko 101 thank you so much for watching and remember something somebody told me just grab yourself a bottle of water and mind your business okay thank you Have an amazing Monday.